right y'all leave your opinion your thoughts in the comment section below it is what it is y'all can dog me out if you want to i'm over it over it It's your girl Joy back with another banger. So I know I'm obsessed with this green jacket. So I just got home. Remember, I told you guys I hadn't heard or seen Clinton, my son, in a couple of days. And as I'm trying to move up out of this place. There aren't many days left, and there's just so much to do. So he was, he's been, I guess, hanging out with his friends or whatever. I'm like, so, I'm like, did you lose your job? What happened to your job? So I don't know. I don't know. So I come home after working like a dog, day in and day out. <laughs> I do. And I'm making me a sandwich, some chips. I do work like a dog. I think I'm gonna have some tomato on my sandwich since it's there. I know this is I'm trying to pack this up. Tomato. I do work like a dog. Non-stop, day in, day out, about six days, sometimes seven days a week about 15, 16 hours a day, I work like a dog. And don't get it twisted. I enjoy what I do, so sometimes it doesn't feel like work. So, you know, I enjoy what I do. It's just frustrating when it is not appreciated and when I'm working harder than Students, I'm trying to cut my tomato, and I'm working harder than students. It's frustrating, but I get home. Remember, got to move up out of here. He first, initially, he had a plan. My son had a plan about some Colorado. Oh, okay, oh, okay. So I got pepper jack cheese. I don't know. I was in the mood for pepper jack. Hold on, please hold. Jeez, like as soon as I start doing stuff, people want to do the email, texting and stuff. Why is this push back? Nobody told you to push that back. He pushed the refrigerator back. No, the refrigerator needs to be pulled out so I can pull the trays out. I can't pull the trays out of the refrigerator to wash them just because of the angle. So he came home from his, uh, I guess his outing with his friends or whatever. He was gone for days and days. And then when I come in the house, I'm smelling something, like food. And I was like, I know he ain't eat my chicken. I know that boy ain't come up here and eat my food. I was gonna take that chicken for lunch. Gone, gone, gone. Have a problem with somebody eating something but when you don't bring in anything and you refuse to to buy food for the house don't come up here and eat my stuff it's just like I'm over it I'm over it and let me tell you something family will be the first ones to take advantage of you but I feel like joy your time is short yeah, time is short. So I asked him, I said, so do you have a plan? Do you have a plan that's coming up? Because we don't have many days left here. He was like, well, I guess, I guess I'll stay at my, um, my friend's house. Oh, okay. So you got a plan then. Because I no longer want to be the plan. The plan that you take advantage of. Mm -mm, I'm over it. I'm telling you, fr friends and family. First ones to take advantage of you. Mm-mm, I'm done.
Good night, blue cheese. I'm done. Mm -mm. Nope. Doesn't try to help. Doesn't nothing. So it's time for you to go. It's time for you to get off the the little the the, the, the money train, the, the bandwagon, whatever you call it. You know what I'm talking about. Child or no child, I'm over it. Mm -mm. Won't contribute nothing. But came up here and ate good though. Ate real good. But won't buy nothing up in here. I'm over it. And you guys can say whatever you want to say. But I'm not taking care of no, of, of, no, of no grown man. And whatever that grown man decided to do with their life. That's his business. I tried. Don't want to listen to anything I say. Don't want to listen to any of my suggestions. Then I'm sorry. You got to figure it out on your own. And why get upset over something? I'm not getting upset. You know why? Because we're down to single digits. Well, we got to get up out of here. Single digits. Why? Why waste my energy? Why waste my breath? Why? I've heard of uh, other stories where parents moved out <laughs> because their 30 and 40 year old children went through anything. I know we feel like we are obligated. I feel like obligation is to a certain age, a certain degree. Yeah. 18 is the legal age. Whether or not they are ready, I've tried. This one's going on 22. I can't take it anymore because the resentment will be worse if I allowed it to continue. People will use you as long as you allow them to use you. People will use you as long as you allow them to use you. So I have an out in my case. I'm leaving. I'm leaving on the next train. Oh, the, the, the back again. Y'all know I don't know the words to no song, right? <laughs> yup. Bye, bye, figure it out. Child, no child. I'm over it. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm. Oh, shoot. So this is pumpernickel bread with ham that I got sliced ham, pepper jack cheese. And I got some sliced salami, you know, from the deli, you know, from the stuff, you know, the stuff that I'm going to put in my room, because I'll come down in the morning or the, or, or the next day, it'll be gone. All of it. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. 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 Say what y'all want to say. I love them, but I'm not gonna have a child, a man, woman, anybody take advantage of me. Mm -mm. No, and I tried, won't pay nothing. Mm -hmm. I even paid a cell phone bill, but I'm trying to. Switch over my plan, and it just seems like every week, and I'm just so busy. But it's coming. And there was no dish soap, so I see he he made some macaroni and cheese. I, I don't know how he did that. I really don't. I don't even remember what was up in that fridge, but I don't know how he made that. And got the pots out and stuff. How you wash? How you wash that? How you wash the pot? How you wash the strainer? How you wash your plate that you ate with my 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 chicken? How do you do that? Remember, we didn't have no dish soap, so you probably use hand soap. Okay, quite innovative, but maybe you could have gone out and bought some hand soap, bought some laundry detergent. I'm over it, y'all. And just because I birthed them. Don't mean I have to tolerate certain things. No, I do not. If that's what you feel comfortable doing, do you? Mm-mm. 
I don't know what happened in college. I don't know. I don't know. He's just living day by day. Mm -mm. I tried. I even had a pastor from a mega church take time out, out of his schedule to talk to him. I tried to talk to him. Tried to get mentors to talk to him. Sometimes some people don't want no help. You just got to find out on his own. Mm -mm. So I was at Starbucks until about 6.15. Hungry. But this pumpkin nickel sandwich, good. I don't really taste much heat from the pepper jack though. All right, y'all. He done made my blood pressure high. Kitchen's a mess. This is so much stuff. <clears throat> Liver room is a mess. <sighs> it's just a lot. It's making my head spit, <laughs> giving me a headache. All right, that tomato was good on there. Added a little extra juice. All right, y'all. Leave your opinion, your thoughts in the comment section below. It is what it is. Y'all can dog me out if you want to. I'm over it. Over it. Over it. Period. <laughs>